They are the Oscars class of 2016. But as the nominees for the 88th Awards met for the annual Academy lunch in Beverly Hills, once again, controversy over the fact that no black actors have been recognized this year. A sea of mostly white faces ever apparent. It ain't about how hard you can hit. It's about how hard you can get hit. Take films like Creed, where many feel actor Michael B. Jordan and the film's black director, Ryan Coogler, were overlooked. In fact, Sylvester Stallone was the only person from the movie to be nominated, revealing that he offered to boycott the Oscars. I remember uh, I spoke with uh, Ryan Coogler when this happened. I said, Ryan, how do you want to handle this? Because I, I really believe that you are responsible for me being here. Michael Jordan, you know, every time I looked in his eyes as an actor, I said he's making me better. I think he should have been uh, given a lot more respect, a lot more attention. I want them back! They're my property! And Stallone was not alone. Nominee and director of action film Mad Max Fury Road, George Miller, also chose to use his platform to make a point. I think what's really good about what's happened is if there's a positive to come out of it, it's alerted everybody to, to, the, to the problem. Um, it's really interesting to me how television um, responded way earlier than I think cinema has. The Academy has since offered to double the number of women and ethnically diverse members by 2020, but with many already threatening to boycott the Oscars over the issue. When the awards happen in three weeks' time, perhaps those who do not attend will cause as much of a scene as those who do. Minnie Stevenson, 5 News.